As gas prices continue to affect daily activities, the Lauderdale County School District is looking to curb those fuel costs by adjusting its bus route for the upcoming school year. Twin States News' Jasmine Stevenson has more. Lauderdale County School District is being proactive to cut the cost of fuel by combining some of their school bus routes. We, we have combined routes at Northeast Elementary and Northeast Middle, and we've made some uh, optimization of routes at uh, Northeast High and at Clarkdale. Uh, so what we'll see this year will be some changes possibly in uh, who your child's driver may be and pickup times will be different. The district wanted to ensure that the taxpayers' money was being spent efficiently. Moore says the amount of money saved by this change depends on the fluctuation of gas prices. We're really not for sure. Uh, you know, we, we, it, it's very much dependent upon uh, fuel cost. Uh, you know, we're hoping to save somewhere maybe around, uh, you know, between the uh, number of buses, maintenance, fuel, maybe $100,000 a year, uh, you know, give or take. As far as how to handle COVID while in the close spaces of a school bus, the district says they are still practicing safety measures. We're still uh, working with some of the uh, same guidelines of which we had last year. Uh, we still uh, have available to our drivers uh, a disinfectant uh, and, you know, uh, the opportunity to clean their buses. Uh, we still have uh, hand sanitizer on every bus so that as children get on and get off, you know, they're welcome to the use of that. As of right now, there is no, uh, uh, there's nothing in place uh, where, you know, we're uh, going to tell them they, they must wear a mask. Wearing a mask is still optional. To find out how your child's school's bus route might be affected, you can reach out to the child's school. Jasmine Stevenson, Twin States News, Meridian.